guys welcome back to my channel and uh, I know I've been away for way too long I was really going through it for those who don't know me I work as an auditor in London and it was busy season so I was really busy I really didn't have much time but I do hope that now uh, busy season has gotten a little bit better I can start making videos in today's video I decided that I'll do something different I have a friend who I'm going to meet up with somewhere close to central London so I thought I'll take you guys along I haven't really vlogged before but I'm really curious and I really would love to try very clean not all houses in London look like this they are normally just dull face break and the neighborhood was really clean At the entrance point of the garden, we didn't have to pay for anything. to look for food and we are not brought food so we left the park and went to some nearby shops to buy some burgers <music> individual spent about 16 pounds the burgers were about nine pounds each and the milkshakes were about six pounds so we then went back to the park to eat and finish off our picnic and just chill and listen to the music Are you blushing? Sweet concussion Oh, you bitch by touching
much the music was now hitting harder <laughs> we're listening to some afro beats uh, some zimbabwean music and just chatting and laughing <laughs> Rainbow houses. Okay, yeah, we're just here to take pictures, see the place, walk around. I don't know anything exciting, really. <laughs> so this neighborhood is one of the is amongst some of the colorful neighborhoods in London. It is said that some famous people also do live here. People like Richard Branson. And it's just generally trendy and they're different color pastels. The houses have vibrant colors. the day was now ending and we just went to the train we were using the central line and we just split there my friend stays in east london whilst i stay in west london so that's when we just separated <laughs> just all smiles and stuff I'm not sure if you guys remember from one of my videos on first impressions about London when I specified that when you are on the escalator you need to stand and sit inside and this is what I was trying to explain in the video you don't have to block the traffic when everyone may want to be walking down the stairs so this marks the end of my vlog. I was now just waiting for my train for me to go back home. And that's it. Thank you guys for watching.